good morning good afternoon and good evening everyone so today the video is about how to downgrade redmi note 9 s or redmi note 9 pro the india variant from android version 11 back to android 10 and from miui version 12 back to miui 11 a request came from my channel viewers that uh, do the practical first and if i get the result success then i can upload a video yes i am succeeded downgrading my redmi note 9 s from miui 12 back to miui 11 and obviously the android version will also be downgraded now one thing i would like to inform this video is about for those users who uh, usually do flashing on xiaomi mobile phone and obviously they must be having an, an unlock bootloader so definitely definitely for those users who is having a lock bootloader and doing a flashing then they must be having a custom recovery installed i am already having a custom recovery installed install those user who want to downgrade the redmi note 9 pro india variant or redmi note 9 s from miui 12 back to miui 11 in case if you want then you can proceed this procedure in your mobile phone there is no need to use a computer you can download the rom file on your mobile phone boot into custom recovery flash the rom downgrade the set to whatever version you want First, I will go to my uh, settings and I will go to about phone to show you that currently I already flashed the India variant or India region ROM of Redmi Note 9 Pro on my Redmi Note 9 S. MIUI version is 12.5.2 and white version is 11. And for doing this, I got me dialer and me SMS application. The global ROM is not having me dialer and me SMS application and also the call recording. Click the link provided in my video, the video description. Download the ROM on your mobile phone. Let me show. Here is the ROM. MIUI 11 version is 11.0.5.0. After downloading the ROM on your mobile phone, then again go to settings and go to password and security. If you have set the screen lock password on, then turn it off. Must turn it off. And go back to settings, then to me account. In case if you are using me account, sync your account once, remove it. Same way, go to account sync, sync your Google account once, remove it. Now, the most important thing is to save all your internal storage data. Like I mean to say, WhatsApp pictures, videos, whatever you have, camera videos, songs, anything. Because this procedure of downgrading will format everything. The data will get washed. Better to save the data. Check the battery should be charged to minimum 50%. Right? Well, if you have downloaded a ROM already on your mobile phone, you must be having an unlock bootloader and you must be having a custom recovery installed. Now, one more thing. For example, those user who have an unlock bootloader but do not have a custom recovery and they still want to downgrade from android 11 back to android 10 comment me in comment section whatever you request in comment section i will try my best to do it and to bring the video if you have done all these things that i just mentioned then press in the power key the power menu will appear and press or tap the reboot Again, tap reboot, then press and hold the volume up key. Let the set to boot into custom recovery. Press and hold the volume up key until the set vibrate, then release the volume up key. Set vibrate, I have released my the volume up key immediately. Wait, let the custom recovery screen appears, then we will continue. Okay, so I am having an Orange Fox recovery and this is the latest official Orange Fox custom recovery for Redmi Note 9 S or Redmi Note 9 Pro India variant. After booting into custom recovery, first of all, tap the last menu, then tap settings and tap display and make the brightness more, bring it to higher, then make the time out to maximum. Well, go back now. Go back to the main screen then tap the second last menu and select the first delvic art cache and then the second cache partition then third data do not select internal storage that's all and then swipe when it is completed tap back 
and then tap to the first menu and tap the download folder then you will see the custom uh, the stock miui 11 rom that you have downloaded already on your mobile phone tap on it to select the rom file then swipe the flashing will get start it will take a time maybe one or two minutes just wait for it let the flashing complete then we will continue and when the flashing gets completed you will see two options here wipe cache and reboot system now here you have to do one important thing and that is go back first to main screen then tap the second last wipe section and then tap the format data you will see here and type yes and then tap here you must need to do this step otherwise the rom will not start boot now you can simply tap reboot system the mobile phone will start booting into miui 11 rom and there is no logo of miui 11 you can see the redmi logo and at the end of the bottom screen powered by android and the three dots is moving now wait the first boot will take a little time finally the first boot complete and uh, you can see the miui 11 uh, welcome screen on your mobile phone now complete the setup screen Finally, you can see I am succeeded downgrading the Redmi Note 9 Pro India variant from Android 11 back to Android 10 and from MIUI 12.5.2 back to MIUI 11. Here we go. Still, I have the Mi Dialer plus the Mi SMS application and definitely I am getting stock call recording and the rest all the things is working are working absolutely fine i hope that you got helped by this video do not forget to like the video do not forget to subscribe my channel thank you for doing that take a good care of yourself we'll see you in my next video until then goodbye